Okay, so here we have a crossing I have toured before, but I thought we'd revisit it to see uh, if anything's changed here. This is Granger Avenue in Lakewood, Ohio. I toured this crossing about a few years ago, but I thought I would just get a tour. I thought I would just tour it again just for the hell of it. This crossing's on the NS Cleveland District. Here's the northern signal. It's got a safe trend base. Safe train gate mechanism with some graffiti on it. 472219 D is the emergency information at this crossing. And then we got two pairs of safe train 12 by 20 inch lights on this signal. Got NEG gate lights. And then up there we got a general signals type 1 electronic bell. Let's go ahead and get over to the southern signal. So a car is coming. Here's the southern signal right here. It's got a safe train base. Safe train gate mechanism. Here's the emergency information again. Two more pairs of safe train 12 by 20 inch lights. And NEG gate lights on this signal as well. Like most crossings in Lakewood, this is another clamp. This is another standard and 90s NS install. It's a better close up of one of the gate lights right there. Like I said, this is crossing located on the NS Cleveland district. Um, this way's looking. This way's looking east towards Cleveland. That next crossing right there is Bonnie View Avenue. And then right there, this way is looking west. This way is looking west towards uh, Rocky River Bay Village, Avon Lake, Sheffield Lake, Lorraine, Bellevue, all those cities. The next crossing down there is Webb Road. Right there, we got the relay case located on the northwest on the northwest quadrant of the crossing. And right there, we got the. Right there we got a signal at milepost 191.7 for westbounds. And it's an automatic block signal, so it and it's off right now, which means that there was no trains in the block right now. I don't know what the it's probably 191.6 or 191.8 for eastbound, but I'd have to guess. So yeah, this is the Granger Avenue Railroad Crossing in Lakewood, Ohio. I've toured this crossing once before, but I thought I would just revisit it to show you guys. Nothing has changed here since I've last toured it. Out.